wanted to make my own guitar and now I've got the opportunity. Well, actually not my own guitar because this is actually a kit guitar from C.F. Martin, Martin Guitars. And uh, it arrived uh, today and with it came this nice little booklet, basic instructions and helpful hints for guitar kit construction. It's only a few pages long, but it makes it sound very easy. I have a feeling it's not going to be quite so easy. In fact, I've got another little book here, which is just a few more pages long. And this one is called Guitar Making Tradition and Technology. And it's the Bible, the reference book for all luthiers and guitarists. Um, so the journey begins. So the box is unpacked. Let's have a look and see what we've got. First, we've got two sides matched um, and bent. So they're basically two sides, but they're still a bit rough and uh, need quite a bit of work on them to smooth them up. There's a matched pair of back sides uh, split down the middle. Those have got to be joined. They do have markings out for the final cut, roughly in place and also for where the bracings will go. Um, along with that, we've got the bracings. These are already roughly cut to size, but they'll still need to be finished on the guitar. There's the kerfling for joining the back and the sides, or the box there together. A nice ebony fingerboard, uh, already with the fret slots cut and with the inlay uh, holes just for the inlays to go in. Here's the neck. The neck is quite uh, finished really, but it's still in a rough state. Um, it's basically got the hole cut for the um, truss rod and uh, it's got the laminate put on the top and it's also had the angle cut correctly with all of the uh, joints and everything put in. So it, the, the worst of the work is done, but there's still all the finishing to be done and the assembly of it, together with the blocks that, um, that have to go into the guitar. So these are still to be fitted because it's only a rough fit at the moment. Um, then we have the soundboard, a nice piece of spruce. Um, and uh, it's already got the, um, the, the hole cut and uh, all of the purfling put in for that. Uh, here we have over here the binding and the purfling. So uh, that's ready to go and as well the frets. There's another little box of tricks here which is just the final bits and pieces like um, we have the bridge and we have the strings. Oop. and scratch board etc so there we are all ready to go looks simple doesn't it have it done in a day i don't think so but we're ready to go mm -hmm. 